Iron deficiency anemia is caused when there is not enough iron in the bloodstream to transport oxygen from the lungs to the cells. Iron deficiency anemia causes fatigue, headache, and dizziness, and craving of non-food substances called pica. Iron-rich foods include soybeans, oysters, and red meat and dark leafy greens. Iron supplements can be taken to increase the amount of iron in the bloodstream. Most iron supplements are given orally, but prescribed iron supplements can be given intravenously or intramuscularly. Iron supplements may cause abdominal discomfort and discoloration of the teeth. We can't have that at the party. You need healthy food. Like what? Iron-rich food. Especially for you, Lauren. Like... Leafy greens! And... Red meat! Uh, and... Fish! Uh, it's gonna be so great! Yay! Yay! Hey, Lauren, Kelly. What, Jackie? We can have more iron-rich foods. Like... Certain cereals. Check your labels. And beans, good for your heart. Coronary heart disease is when plaque builds up in the arteries of the heart and limits blood supply to the heart. Plaque buildup is a collection of fat, calcium, cholesterol, and other substances found in the blood. The pictures on the left depict what happens when one gets coronary heart disease. There are many factors that increase one's chance of contracting CHD, including but not limited to age, gender, or relatives with or without heart disease and also include diabetes, increased cholesterol, and substance abuse. One can prevent CHD by reducing unhealthy fats and cholesterol, the amount of sodium in your diet, and by eating fresh fruits and vegetables. Type 2 diabetes is caused when cells become resistant to insulin, which moves sugar into the cells. This sugar builds up in the bloodstream into unsafe levels. The picture on the right depicts this happening. Type 2 diabetes symptoms include fatigue, hunger, increased thirst, and infections of the bladder, kidney, and skin occurring more often than usual, but these symptoms may not appear at first, developing over time. Tests are needed to tell if one does definitely have type 2 diabetes. It cannot be diagnosed through simple means.
type 2 diabetes is very common and each case must be handled differently but there are several treatments including insulin insulin is injected into the body so that the cells will absorb the sugar in the bloodstream Insulin pumps are used to automatically inject insulin into the bloodstream. Accurate injections of insulin help reduce the number of large swings in your blood glucose level. The two pictures on the right depict insulin pumps. Diabetes and anemia! Yeah. 